All right, now we go to the three times three matrix. So solve the following system of equations by using a joint method. First step is you write the equation into the matrix form 3, 1, 2 3, 2, 2 and 1, 0, 1 and then x, y, z The matrix B will be 11, 10, and 5. Here is the matrix A, matrix X, and matrix B. Then, for the second step, you need to find the A inverse by using a joint method, which is 1 over modulus A, adjoint of A. What is adjoint A? Adjoint A is the matrix of cofactor of A that we transpose. So first, we find the modulus A, which is the determinant of A, by using the third row. Because there is zero there to make your work easy here. Okay, so by using third row, we get plus one, one, two, 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 minus zero, three, two, three, two, and then plus one, three, one, three, two. Then you proceed with 1, 2 minus 4, minus 0, 6, minus 6, which is 0 also, plus 1, 6 minus 3. Then you calculate, you will get the value is 1. So the determinant of A is 1. Then, one more thing that you need to find is the cofactor of matrix A. So, what is the matrix of cofactor of A? We continue with adjoint. Adjoint of A is... Here, the transpose of this matrix. So, what? Uh, the, the matrix here, the value of the elements <coughs> 2, 2, 0, 1 here 3, 2, 1, 1 3, 2, 1, 0 1, 2, 0, 1 3, 2, 1, 1 3, 1, 1, 0 Lastly, 1, 2, 2, 2 3, 2, 3, 2 3, 1, 3, 2 Is there everything? No not enough yet don't forget you are doing the matrix of cofactor not minor so cofactor don't forget all the symbol here understand then we proceed we calculate You will have two negative one, negative two, 
negative 1, 1, 1, negative 2, 0, 3. So what is the transpose of this? It is 2, negative 1, negative 2, negative 1, 1, 1, and negative 2, 0, 3. Understand? Then, you need to find the A inverse. As you know, by using adjoint method, A inverse is 1 over the determinant of A, you times it with adjoint A. So, 1 over 1 times it with 2, negative 1, negative 2. Negative 1, 1, 0. Negative 2, 1, 3. Then you will have the final solution 2, negative 1, negative 2, negative 1, 1, 0, and negative 2, 1, 3. Understand? Now, since the question didn't ask for A inverse, the question asks for X, Y, Z, you need to continue your solution with. As you know, x is equal to a inverse b. So, a inverse a 2, negative 1, negative 2, negative 1, 1, 0, and negative 2, 1, and 3. Times it with, oh, times it with b. b is 11, 10, and 5. By using your knowledge of multiplying two matrices, you will get the final answer here, 2, negative 1, and 3. Then, don't forget the conclusion. So, here x will be 2, the value of y will be negative 1, and the value of z is 3. That's how you solve the system of linear equation for three unknowns. Do you understand everyone?